Hi, I'm Tom Morton, PGA Director of Player Performance here at Hagen Oaks. Today we're going to do a little golf tip on the putting green. Most people when they're working on putting really focus on putting it in the hole, not so much focused on distance control. And what happens is, you know, the average golfer leaves themselves with those 20, 30, 40, 50 foot putts a lot, and they end up three putting, not so much because they didn't put it online, but because of speed control issues. While a lot of times we're asked, how do I work on my speed? Well, here's a great drill we can do in order for you to have a uh, great strategy on how to have a, make sure that you're putting at the right distance. So as we pan down here, what we have set up is we have set up a system where you can learn whether it's going to be a one ball putt or a two ball putt or a three ball putt. So when you practice, you want to lay it out like this and just hit some putts where first we're going to putt it to the, swing it back to the first ball. Okay. And that puts it out there maybe five or six feet. Go ahead and hit another one and I'm going to swing this back to the second ball. Okay. And put that one out there. And that's going to go maybe to 10, 11 feet. And then we're going to go to this last ball. Okay. And that's going to get me out there to that, you know, 20, 25 foot range, which is going to cover most all the putts you're going to see. Anything longer, you might need to grip it a little harder, or you might have to swing it back to a fifth ball if you have one of those really long putts. So, again, to summarize, first of all, work on your distance control in your putting. That's something that oftentimes we see people are not doing. And then second of all, test out this drill. And so when you get on the golf course, you're going to be much more confident to look at it and say, hey, this is a two ball putt. I've done this many times before. This has been Tom Morton for your golf tip on the green.